hello you guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here make sure to subscribe and like this video today's video is a really exciting one but also a really sad one basically what day is it it's june no it's not june it is may 23rd i think today and tomorrow is carly's birthday carly is my best friend if you don't know she lives with me um, we moved to Queensland together and she's actually moving back to Melbourne which is really sad and I'm not going to be with her for her birthday and since knowing each other we've known each other for like seven or eight years now we've never had a birthday apart so yeah we've decided that we're going to make tomorrow her fake birthday but I'm telling myself it's actually her real birthday and then when her actual real birthday is and she spends it with all her other friends or our friends that's her fake birthday so I don't get FOMO but I'm going to make sure tomorrow is the funnest and best day. It is the day before her birthday and it's prep day so I need to go to the supermarket and get some stuff because I'm making her a cake and we're just doing all the fun stuff so I thought I'd bring you guys along but let's go get her stuff. I'm currently at the shopping centre because I need to go to the supermarket and get some stuff and then i need to do some last minute shopping as you guys know i'm like obsessed with birthdays not just my own birthday obviously but other people's birthdays like one of my last videos i surprised my sticky yacht for a birthday my mum's birthday i booked her a trip to byron carly's birthday last year i booked us a trip to gold coast like i've always loved going above and beyond for birthdays because it's like my favorite thing ever but this year i'm obviously leaving to europe for four months in two weeks which is crazy so i don't have like endless amount of funds but i want to make today as special as possible and i wanted to do all these things so i'm trying to do my best and i'm a little like but i know she'll love it like i know carly does not care whatsoever like she is the most chillest person like doesn't expect anything it's just like me like i'm obsessed with birthdays like i'm such an extra person but we're still gonna make it the best okay you guys i just got some things so i got some cakes because i'm gonna decorate them these are carly's favorite they're the white chocolate ones my favorite are the caramel but it's carly's birthday and then i got these cookies these are the best cookies ever. They're the salted caramel and white chocolate cookie from Coles. Oh my god, that's amazing and Carly really likes them. Um, the reason I found those actually is because of Immy. She got me onto these cookies. Oh, they have a vegan one. That's really cute. She got me into another cookie. Where are they? Which are really, really good. These ones. No, not those ones. Oh, I don't know which one it was that Immy got me onto. But they're amazing, but these ones are definitely even better. Do yourself a favor and go and try those. So, oh my god, I'm not getting these, but if you want to try a really good snack, these are amazing. But I don't know why I'm just showing you that. Also, has anyone tried this yet? I want to try it, but I'm not going to get it because this is not my birthday. Okay, guys, that's how it's looking. I need to go to Woolworths to see if they have some things. Alright, we're going down the escalator right now, guys. I am home. So... I bought obviously the two white chocolate mud cakes because I want to make like those really trendy Pinterest cakes because they're really really cute and they're like a hundred and like fifty dollars to get made because I got one made for my sister's birthday and I felt like I could make one myself and I made them before. I didn't really feel like making it from scratch today and then I bought the literal best icing in the world. So that's what I'm gonna spend the next like hour and a bit doing. So I'm opening the icing right now and I think I wanna make the cake pink, but like a really light pink, nothing super obnoxious. Do I have food on my face? No, that's a pimple. Guys, that's her so far. I still need to clean her up and stuff. I think she's looking okay. How does that look? Looks good. We've been sitting here for about two hours doing what I'll show you. The cake is done. I'm not sure if I've shown you the cake. But as I said, Carly is moving away. So I wanted to do something meaningful and that is like a cute little present. Um, but also something that she can remember. And made these little cards. Um, that's like her actual birthday card. And then I haven't actually written the letters yet. And I'm going to fill all of these up. Okay, you guys. It is currently 4.49. That literally took me longer than i thought but i just finished all of the notes i didn't like show you guys what i wrote in them but we've got when you're stressed when you're on a night out with your friends when you're feeling insecure when you're heartbroken when you think you're in love when you're on the plane 
when you miss me, when you're bored, when you're having a menti B, and when you're sad. So, and then there's another one, but I'm not going to read that one out. It's done. Her actual card is done. So that actually took a little bit. I just finished blowing up heaps of balloons. So sorry if you can hear Victoria's in the background, but mum just went and bought me wrapping paper. So I now need to wrap this present. I got her the moon milk from Naked Harvest. I'm whispering because Carly's upstairs still asleep, but I'm downstairs and I'm gonna decorate this table and make it cute for when she walks down the stairs. <laughs> That's still up from Jackie's birthday, so let's go. Guys, so I've brought down all of the balloons, but I don't know if I like them there. I'm thinking maybe putting them down the stairs so when she walks down, they're there. What do you guys think? I think I'm going to put them on the stairs. Guys, this is what we've got so far. I have all the balloons on the stairs. That was actually so hard to do because I kept bouncing off the table setter. Um, put some cookies out and her cake, which is still in the fridge. I don't want to get... Oh, should I get it out now? I might get it out now. Um, I'm going to make myself a cup of tea and make her a cup of tea because I'm going to wake her up in like 15 minutes. She drinks her tea like... 20 minutes after she makes it because it's like really hot for her okay you guys i got the cake out this is what it looks like okay, it's about to turn seven o'clock so i'm gonna go wake up i don't know why i'm nervous like there's literally nothing to be nervous about but i'm scared morning happy <laughs> oh, did you shit yourself yeah a little bit oh, <laughs> Good morning! Happy <laughs> birthday! Oh my god! I'm you look naked. so tanned! And you're naked! I'm naked. <laughs> Let's go! Oh! <laughs> That's so cute! Oh, okay! Oh, I made you a tea as well. Oh! Because I knew you were. Closer to coming to milk. Oh yes, I am. Carly's reading a card. It's kind of a. Um... <laughs> <laughs> That's not it is. This is the most reading I've ever done. <laughs> you think you know what it is? No. Oh really? <gasps> Yay! <laughs> hey guys. So good morning. Good morning. Well, Carly has opened her present as you guys saw. Now we're going to reveal where we're going up first and why she needs to put on workout clothes. So I'm going to show you what we're doing. <laughs> so we are going to Strong Pilates. <gasps> yes! But it's yeah. a lower body session and it's not just Pilates. So it's like a cardio Pilates. So you do the rower and you do, and you have to do like, it's like, they give you weights. Oh, that's Mitchell. Oh like, my god. Weight. Yay. And like there's weights and you're doing the weights on the pull up. Like, oh my god. So we're going to die. We're going to die. Like it's really hard apparently. And it's like the lower body session. Yeah. I'm so excited. We've always been the same. Like, I'm really nervous. <laughs> yeah. I'm All right. We're at the back. Yeah. No. <laughs> die. <laughs> Let me collapse. We are in our workout gear. And... Yeah. We are going to go to Strong in Southport. As we are here, we're gonna I'm go excited. do our Pilates. Same. Oh my god, let's okay, go inside. We, we have to come a bit earlier because we don't actually know how to do it. So. <laughs> This is the bathroom of Strong. It's so nice. They have some cute little <laughs> quotes. Okay. And then it just that was it so was good. so much fun. I highly recommend going to Strong. They have them everywhere. Yeah. They have them in Melbourne. They have them in um, um, Queensland. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Queen's Land. And I'm sure they have them other places. Or just do Pilates. But that was literally so much fun. So we're now heading to breakfast. I don't know where we're going. Carly doesn't know where we're going. But she's going to be really excited when she figures it out. So I'm going to put in the maps. And let's go. <laughs> All right, guys. We are at the place. We're going to the cardamom pod. Carly knows now. She basically guessed. Which good point. Guys, we're out for breakfast. So this toasty is the best toasty in the whole world. You have to get it. Like, I've literally never had a better toasty. No. Same. Um, then we're trying to decide what acai bowl to get because this one looks better. Like, as in, we've had we've had these before. That one like looks more Instagram because it has a yeah. mermaid tail on it. Like, I'm sorry, <laughs> I'm literally a mermaid. But then this one sounds better. So we're like, what do we want? Juice has arrived. Yeah. Did you just spill it? I love a good is it good? The acai bowl has come. Look how good it looks. This is a Snickers acai bowl, so it's meant to taste like a Snickers. That's a raw Snickers slice. Um, I asked them to put the mermaid on it. Oh my god, my nails are so yum. There's the peanut butter. Yum. Guys, it is here. The mermaid tail literally fell off. Like, look at that. So that was not great. Toasty, let's go. So guys, we just finished getting ready. I'll show you guys my outfit. Mind you, I have a new blazer came. Ew. That is my tan on my pillow. Let's not look at that. The weather has gone so nice for us, but we're on the way to dinner. We're going to the Tropic at Burley. I'm so excited. I've never been to the Tropic before. It's like right next to the pavilion. So we're going to do a fit check. Carly's looking <laughs> great. Okay, let's do your fit check first. All right. Where's the skirt from? Katie. Oh, yeah. I bought that for her for her birthday ages yeah. ago. And then the top. Glasses. Okay, my turn. Um, yeah, it actually is. Jeff Avenue. Yeah. Universal. Um, I don't know where the boots are from, I forget, but go on Instagram, I tag them. And Universal! Guys, we are at the Tropic. It is so nice. Mum and... I was going to say Mum and Dad. Oh, well, Mum and Dad. Mum and Carly just got their glass of wine. They bought a bottle. And this is the view. There was people staring at me over there. It's literally so gorgeous. I, the food is here. Look at the view. Look at that pasta. That looks insane. We have the puppy bread. Who's gonna poke the bread? Me. Poke the bread. bread. Ready, go. <laughs> we finished the food. Devoured. Look at the view though, guys. What does the MILF mean? I know what it means. What does it mean? Mother, I'd like to have sex with. <laughs> What, Neil? Oh, you're saying there's a... Are you the one year close to becoming a milk? We're making some tea. Mum's a little bit tipsy. Mum's talking about how she was drinking a bottle of wine. Well, I paid for that bottle. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, birthday to you. The MILF. <laughs> Happy birthday, birthday to you. Happy birthday, birthday to you. Hooray! 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 I promise to block the whole footy. I'm late and I'm going to bed. <laughs> I've never eaten so much but I literally remember last year on Carly's birthday I literally felt the exact same way um because when it's your best friend's birthday or when it's your birthday or when it's anyone's birthday or when it's any day you want you can eat as much as you want never feel guilty for eating and just a reminder to anyone that may be struggling no matter how much you ate today you still need to eat tomorrow but anyway, I had the whole cake and I was just getting a spoon, just eating it. 
and then she had cookies from this morning and she was just dipping her cookies into biscoff because she's like obsessed with biscoff at the moment i may continue this vlog on sunday because that is carly's last day and then she's moving back to melbourne she's driving home gave carly some cookies and some flowers why can't i and chocolates and this is how they train me so sweet it's carly's last night here and mum got Carly some treats for her car ride because she's driving back to Melbourne. So we were going to show you, but I already ate them. <laughs> some harvest snacks. Do you want to show? Yeah. So mum got her some harvest, harvest snacks, snacks. Some snacks, shapes. Shapes. Some honey soy chips, which you already ate. May or may not have already ate. Some red frogs, which definitely did not already sour, sour red frogs. Um cute card all travel stuff for the plane like um do i show them what yeah, you have to say no so we have a adapter hug, an adapter um a head pillow to put around your head how cute is this it's, it's a, a chicken zebra with a a chicken it's that so is the cute. cutest thing oh and oh the little unicorn for a bag a travel lock to lock it some lip balm for your lips and sanitizer. Love that. Um, Mum hasn't gone to me any of this. By the way. <laughs> um, like a mini Colgate. These are the flowers and work gave Carly. And some chocolates that she already had as well. <laughs> and she wrote a really good card for me. And mm. look how cute. Now me and Carly are gonna pack up her room. Oh, that's actually emotional. Felt like showing you what we're working with. So this is my room. You come out into the corridor. This is how close me and Kylie have been living for the past four months. This is her room. Her room. My room. Her room. And now we're going to be miles, miles and miles apart. Do you know what that's off? Hannah Montana. High School Musical. Good try. That's what I meant. <laughs> Look at what has been packed. We've packed up all of her stuff. That's all good to go. That's all going in her car. Kylie's a bit stressed out yeah, because... <laughs> Do you want to tell them why you're stressed out? Hasn't got her Mr. Winston jumper and she's scared. The Melbourne girl is back in force. But anyway, all of her drawers are being, being cleaned out. Well, not really cleaned, but like they've got nothing in them. And in the bathroom, all of her drawers are gone as well. So this girl is no longer. Don't cry. Look at my head right I'll now. Lose focus. <laughs> Look at my fucking head. <laughs> Hello everyone. Happy moving day for Carly. Not happy though. All her stuff is down here. We're about to pack up her car, but we're going for breakfast this morning. So I've got my fit on. That Carly stuff. It's emotional guys it's really emotional so carly has obviously left and the goodbye was obviously really emotional because we we're running really late and she had to go pick up a friend um from the airport because they were driving back together so it was just really emotional and i had to say goodbye really quickly and i didn't know what was happening and then when she left i just burst out in tears but honestly it's been the best experience moving up here with my best friend and living together like i just i know i'll cherish all these moments forever and i'm so grateful and i'm so excited for our next chapter of our life and i just want to say it's not a goodbye it's a see you later